everyone, my name is Christine Gibson and I'm the Education Coordinator here at Oklahoma Contemporary Arts Center and today I'm going to share with you a little bit about our learning gallery and the learning gallery here is for our Jeffrey Gibson Speak to Me exhibition which will run through June 11th. So we're going to start here in our pop-up library. Um, all these books relate to the exhibition in some way and they were graciously um, or on loan from the Metropolitan Library System. And uh, so those, if you have a bookworm, that would be perfect for them. So maybe if you have a little toddler with you, this would be a perfect activity for them. Jeffrey's work has a lot of geometric shapes. So here they can uh, create their own pattern, but if they're just learning their shapes, they can match up the shapes on the sheets that we have provided. Okay, let's walk over this way. Jeffrey Gibson has a lot of fantastic beadwork in it, and we wanted our kids and some adults to enjoy that as well. So here at our beading station, we have beads and yarn and pipe cleaners for them to cre create their own works of art. Look at this. I created this today. Isn't it beautiful? And um, over here is our Share Some Words wall. He also has some great text in his work, and um, we wanted you to express yourself as well. So uh, we invite our visitors to come here, write something that is important to them. So I'm going to do I heart art. And that's what I want to leave on the board today. So I'm going to put that right there. And I can share it with all the other visitors. Now this has been my favorite so far. Can we get a close up on that one? How adorable is that? <laughs> Okay, we have a couple more things to show you. Over here are our touch tiles. Jeffrey's work is very textile and everybody wants to touch it, even the adults. So here you have an opportunity to actually touch some of the materials he uses. Here are the tin jingles that make some fantastic noises. And here he uses some animal hide, animal skin. Lots of fringe and yarn is in his show. And he also has these fantastic ceramic heads. Um, so this area here just gives you an opportunity to, to touch some of the material that he uses and drift to wood and last but not least the exact piece that he likes to use. Okay, so over here for maybe our more advanced reader, we have some uh, photographs by La Lester Hergera and they actually are close-ups um, of some Native Americans and uh, they each have a description and they kind of go into a little bit more detail of the materials used in some of um, Jeffrey Gibson's work and some of the points that he likes to talk about. So that is our learning gallery. This will be open till June 11th, so you have plenty of time to get in and play.